Arrive in Jerusalem on a Saturday and the city is quiet, observant, peaceful for the Sabbath. But just wait. The city comes alive with a clash of culture, religion, sounds and smells from the call to prayer to the burning of incense. Here are my tips for Jerusalem's old city. Skip the free tours and take a guided half-day, full-day walking tour, ideally one that covers more than one religion. That way, you'll understand the interconnectedness of the face and how one site can have a holy significance in more than one religion. That's what's so interesting about Jerusalem. The sites just layer on top of each other as foundation stones for each progressive religion. Tip number two, pack lightweight long sleeves and long pants, things that are breathable and easy to wear in hot weather, but that fully cover your body. We learned this the hard way at Dome of the Rock, where they insisted we wear long skirts to cover our legs. Enjoy this photo, we didn't really prepare. Be aware, you will notice more military presence everywhere you go. Every tourist attraction, especially at things like the airport or transit centers, embrace for that and plan extra hours so that you have enough time to get through all the security measures. If you want more time at the sites, try to visit them early in the morning or late at night after all the crowds, after the tours, so you get more reflective time there. And when you're there, stop and listen. Thank you.